Thanks for sticking with us here on Fox 24 News AM Live. Our cultural correspondent, Randy yes. Hamm. He on Baby Friday. Back on Baby Friday, back yes. in action. We're yes. so happy to have you back I'm on our set. so happy to be back here. I missed you all. We missed you too, Randy. Yes. Oh my goodness. It wasn't the same, but you're here. Yes, I am. And I'm so ready to hear about the Recycle Fashion Show. Me too. It is one of my favorite things that happens in the fall. Mm -hmm. uh, I've been working with Keep Out Us a Beautiful uh, with this for several years now, and I love to see how it's grown. It started as this little Recycle Fashion Show as part of the Permian Basin Fair, mm -hmm. and there were like maybe six contestants, and we had li these old folding tables, and I was a judge, <laughs> and, and all these uh, designers would come out and they would make these incredible garments out of um, you know refuse and uh, repurposed clothing I saw right. this really cool like a uh, skirt made out of ties oh wow like this. yeah and um, so I thought that was really cool and mm -hmm. in three years it's grown into this big huge gala and uh, now it's gonna be at the new Marriott Hotel and Convention Center it's on oh, September wow. 20th uh, one of the judges is Daniel Esquivel, Project Runway Season 11 designer. Right. Yeah. What? Exactly. Okay, that's pretty cool. That is awesome. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so it's getting a lot of um, attention mm -hmm. um, statewide, and we're really, really happy about that. But most importantly, we're happy that we are teaching people how to reduce, reuse, and recycle. Right? Exactly. Yeah, so. I love that. And people, okay, so they're actually using trash. Yeah. to create these beautiful works of art and then they get to display it on a runway. Yes, final it is product. a total runway show. It is, if you've seen Project Runway, think mm -hmm. of the Unusual Materials Challenge okay. because that's what it is. Uh, and the call for entries starts right now. So you have Ooh. all summer to collect your trash and turn it into something beautiful. And there uh, are a ton of creative people out here. Yeah, so I'm amazed. I'm so excited to see what you guys come up with. But um, what are the requirements for being able to apply for the fashion show? Uh, it's, it's very simple. There's two categories. Okay. Uh, category one is ages 8 to eight, 17, and then adults 18 and over. So you could start as young as 8 years old. And some of these kids have some fantastic designs. Mm -hmm. uh, your garment has to have at least 50% recycled or reused, repurposed material. Okay. Uh, and um, yeah, I think that's about it. If you have any other questions, make sure you call the Keep Odessa Beautiful offices. They'll be happy to. Um, you know, help you out with uh, all of the requirements. But I can't wait to see what's on the runway this year. I yeah. mean, it is just one year, somebody made a mermaid costume oh, out no. of plastic <laughs> spoons. They made the scales out of plastic that spoons. It was so awesome. so creative. Yeah. And that look, too. I can imagine right. the, the yeah, shape. It's very... kind of concave, and so it has right. that kind of scale-like texture to it. Yeah, yeah. That's and awesome. as you saw in the graphic, um, the winning costume from last year, the winning design, the crown was so appealing that mm -hmm. Daniel Esquivel bought it from the designer and took it back to Austin, and you saw it all over his Instagram wow. for months. That little crown from Odessa, Texas. That is so I amazing. Thought that was sort of cool. yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm so excited. I'm pumped for this event, and yeah, it's going to be at the Marriott Hotel. Yes, it's. I think it's their very first big event after they open, so it's nice. September 20th. I'm really excited about it. Very, very excited as well. And what other events do you have coming up? You know, tonight, as a matter of fact, the 61st annual Juried Art Show at the Ellen Noel Art Museum is opening. Okay. Uh, and I'm really excited about this. It starts at 6 o'clock. Um, the winner from last year's juried show gets his own solo exhibit this year for the first time and his name is Nick Baskus and I actually own one of his pieces because he is such a fantastic artist. Wow. So come out and see what Nick has done. Come out and see what all of the other artists of the Permian Basin have done. Uh, you're going to find some incredible stuff and most of it's for sale. So if you need some art for your house, this is a place to go find it. That is amazing. Well, thank you so yeah. much for being in our studio today, Randy. I'm yeah, so excited for you. all of these events. It's yeah. so incredible to see just how much Odessa Arts has impacted West Texas. Well, thank you it's very amazing. much. Yeah. Well, coming up here, all of your entertainment news.